Okay, final look over Las Vegas because we are going home to the Netherlands today. And to be totally honest, I won't miss the heat, but I will miss all the guys and you guys at Photoshop World because this was an amazing week. And of course, we also loved San Francisco. So, we're getting ready to go back home. And that means that this episode will actually be online a lot later than you guys are expecting because the trip will take a long time. We have one in between stop in Minneapolis and then off to Amsterdam, Schiphol. Erika, are you almost ready with packing up? Yes. You see the suitcases? I see the suitcases. And this was our room. We always love the Mandalay. Great rooms. And, well, I don't know if we're gonna have a problem, but these are our suitcases. We bought a lot of stuff, man, and we're just barely on weight. So it's gonna be fun to see uh, if everything's gonna go right. And it won't be fun if it won't go right, but I think it will be right, right, Annemiek? Yes, it will be okay. Okay, so I'm gonna pick up the car and load up, hold the baggage, and then pick up my parents and Brian. Okay, again, a little bit of Tetris, but it worked. So our whole car is absolutely filled up to the brim, and we still have room for our passengers. So let's go to the airport. Returning the rental car and getting all the stuff out. Okay, at Las Vegas airport, blistering hot outside, sardines in a bus, and now we arrived, checking in. And luckily, sky priority, because we have a silver status. Now the thing that always struck me from Vegas is that even when you're on the airport, there are gambling machines everywhere. Amazing, right? Everywhere you can gamble, even on the airport. Okay, there's our plane. D43. D34. Boarding the plane for Minneapolis first leg and we are at gate D34. Boarding the plane. So first plane, not a really big one, but it will get us there. Okay, nice exit row seats. Getting ready for takeoff. Okay, Brian, we have to hurry, so let's take a car like we did with Peter early. No? Okay, let's just walk. Okay, waiting in Minneapolis for the connecting flight, which will take approximately an hour and a half, two hours before we leave, and then up to Amsterdam and home. Okay, an incredibly modern airport with digital displays, loads of charging spaces, and nice seating areas. Very nice. We're boarding the second flight to Amsterdam. So almost home. Well, six more hours or so to go. But that will be doable. Okay, great seats. Very close to the bulkhead. Okay, plenty of leg room. You see Brian's feet. It's always nice when you have seats like this. <laughs> okay, one more hour for Amsterdam. Okay guys, on our way to baggage claim and then 
Let's hope our car is there because we used valet and then to Emma Lords. Okay, grabbing our luggage. Waiting for the luggage and then home. Okay, never saw this at Schiphol. Cool. And no, that's not Dutch. Waiting for the valet. Now we just had a conversation with somebody. He said it's extremely hot. And I was going out, going like, this is really nice compared to Vegas. This is like, it's not cool, but it's certainly not hot. So it'll probably take me a few days to get used to this weather again. So, well, the flight was okay. The only problem was we got a lot of extra miles from Delta. So compliments to Delta because we had a long delay and our entertainment system didn't work, the lights didn't work and it was incredibly hot in the plane. But Delta, compliments, they gave us a lot of extra miles. So we're now waiting for Valet to bring our car and then we go home. Finally, taking a shower because I'm so glad this is not Smellorama. I hate airplanes who are way too hot. So, well, We'll film as soon as we're home, guys, but that can take another 90 minutes. But for you, the video, it's the next scene. Okay, guys, Brian is already unloading the car. And in the distance, you can see the studio. We're back home. And now where normal people would go lay down and relax, I have to start doing backups and, yeah, start on cataloging everything and making backups and making sure that everything works so no rest for Frank but hey we love our work okay I'm creating the final backup now on our Western Digital and this is a really cool one this is a my passport pro and it's pretty small well, it's not really small of course but it's relatively small because it has two drives and the two drives are actually configured into a mirror mode and that means that via the internal attached Thunderbolt cable I can make backups that are relatively safe because the two drives are connected in mirror means if one drive fails we still have the other one so I'm now making the final backup from the laptop now I'm gonna connect my original hard drives again to the empty slots you see over there and then we're gonna import everything into Adobe Lightroom Hey guys, so we're back home. All the backups are done. We're ready for uh, a relaxing evening. And that also means that now that we're home, that the next behind the closed doors will actually take a little bit of a time. Because, well, tomorrow and the day after, I will try to take some time off. Because, let's be totally honest, Photoshop world, long nights, uh, sorry, short nights, very short nights, and long travel, it really takes a toll on you. And I didn't want to go to bed straight away because then you have a terrible jet lag. So we actually worked today as soon as we came home. So that means that the next two days, <laughs> I will be off. I will have no social media. Well, we'll probably have social media, but no behind the closed doors. Hey, as you guys could see in the video, that first plane was horrendous. It literally was like somebody left the window open. I've never been scared in a plane in my life. But this one, oh my, this was terrible. It really scared the out of me. And on the video you can actually not hear the way it was. Every time the plane flexes, and a plane normally flexes of course, you hear this amazing sound and amazing in a bad way. It was literally like somebody left the window open. Even the guys behind me were going like this is not good. And I just hoped we didn't crash. And at the end we didn't crash, we landed because hey, I'm still here. Then we got another problem. We got delayed on the first flight. The second flight great plane great seats but way too hot like literally way too hot but again as mentioned before Delta solved this now what you didn't see because at that time we didn't know yet was we had our car parked at Schiphol via Valet meaning they pick up the car as soon as you arrive at Schiphol and they bring it back as soon as you're there and well, they went around the car and they noted like, okay, there's a little bit of a dent over here, there's a little bit of a scratch over there. And we got it back and I actually got into an argument with the guy because believe it or not, this is how we got our car back. There's half a tree sitting here. This part is all broken. And here you can see it a little bit from the bottom. So they just hit something with the bumper. And there's a scratch over here 
And according to the guy, that was already there. So I told him like, yeah, I always drive around with a tree between my uh, bumper, right? So we made a note, we made pictures, we signed the form with, of course, under protest. So let's hope they solve this correctly because this was not, I repeat, not how we delivered our car. So anyway guys, for the next two days, no behind the closed doors. But I will pick it up again on Tuesday when we start doing the retouching. And we're going to show you some of the end results of course and the retouching process. So thank you so very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed our videos in the States and of course Photoshop World. If you like them please let us know in the comments below or via social media. And of course support us via Patreon because thanks to Patreon this is all possible. So for now. I've been up for a long time and I think it's time for Frank and Anna Week to go to bed because Brian already fell asleep after the first half hour he was home. So it's, it's literally a long haul. So thank you so very much for watching guys and see you around. Bye bye and see you on Tuesday.